girls welcome and welcome back to this channel thank you guys so much for being here and showing all your love and support i really do appreciate it please be sure to like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and make sure that your post notifications are turned on so you know every single time that i post so i'm gonna go ahead and tap into some messages to see what's going on and we'll go from there like i said be sure to like comment and subscribe as it does help out the channel if you need a reading, be sure to check the About section. And also, if you are interested in uh, messages that go beyond these general readings, then be sure to um, tap into the membership by clicking the Join button, okay? So I was picking up on a energy about bungalows, okay? I don't know why but there's something specific about bungalows i don't know if somebody's a realtor or somebody's flipping homes or this could be a home that you live in but somebody may be downsizing as well to a smaller home or somebody feels like they need a um, bigger space that lives in a smaller home take it as it resonates okay anyway So picking up the word impeachment you have emotional storm and confusion somebody doesn't know why they feel a certain way or why they feel like um, unstable emotionally somebody's unclear of what's going on somebody feels like they can't trust someone maybe this is why a person's emotions are being stirred up but I feel like this is just a distraction whatever you're not trusting about or believing in this is a distraction to keep you off of making some type of change or change coming in or some sort of delay you are supposed to be withdrawn from something so that whatever it is that you're escaping somebody's escaping some sort of confession hmm. let's see here message for Virgo. Tell me more about this emotional storm. Ooh. Okay, so we have the seven of swords. Somebody's lying, deceiving, manipulating, cheating. Um, we also have this person could be a criminal. Sorry, y'all. So, whatever this emotional storm is in regards to, it has something to do with a person that may be holding a secret or something like that. And it was confirmed in this deck. You could be dealing with an earth sign, a water sign. The number 28, 28 could be significant. It's coming out twice. Somebody's life path number could be 6 or 3. I'm also seeing the number 21. Okay. So there's a king of pentacles that could be eager for some type of decision or something that he feels needs to work out in his favor. Okay. He could be consulting with friends about something. Maybe he's confiding in these friends. 28 is significant. I'm getting it three times. 28, 28, 28. Okay? Somebody here needs to look up the angel number 28. Okay? Somebody is definitely lying, cheating, manipulating, deceiving, or there's some sort of like uh, criminal activity that's going on. I feel like somebody's trying to distance themselves from something. Somebody wants nothing to do with that or any type of association with this two of wands here. I'm going to go ahead and clarify. Let's see. What is this Knight of Pentacles eager to make a decision or have clarity about? It could, whatever this is with this Knight of Pentacles, it could be including... Uh, three people six of pentacles in reverse 
somebody abused their power or authority or somebody here may have may have asked for gifts with strings attached somebody's in a in a strings attached type of connection and they use that to abuse power or authority. Somebody here could be having a, a relationship or this friend knows about what this Knight of Pentacles is doing or vice versa. We have the Page of Cups to the Moon. Somebody is being bribed to keep something a secret or to um, allow somebody to feel like something is all in their head. Eight of Cups in the middle of the deck. Somebody could be stagnated or stagnating something or accepting less and not wanting to change anything because they're in fear of what that change looks like. Somebody is staying in a bad situation and keeping a secret about it. Somebody is sleeping with a person that's giving them gifts or someone that abuses generosity or uses power to make people be compelled to them what's the six of pentacles okay magician so there's something about a gemini libra aquarius somebody here could be um doing silent spells that is wearing off if they are doing it Somebody could be trying to silence a person or not allow somebody to make a clear decision. Yeah, somebody is in this maybe or unknown stage, but I feel like somebody is going to um, balance their crown and their throat chakra. This is the queen of wands. Somebody is showing a person that they could be confident no matter what's being done behind the scenes. is being exposed somebody is being exposed for being a um, a unaliver or somebody that may have caused a person harm or tortured an individual something is not closed out or done something here was not to be closed up until somebody lacked achievement or felt like they were empty or withdrawn from something. Somebody here could have been trying to do something through retrograde or whatever this is. Somebody's running away from issues but getting trapped in the same problems they're running away from. What's this confusion? Somebody made a deal with a powerful person that gave them a, a, a strings attached gift in order to cause problems to their own life or somebody else's life. What's this confusion? Actually, I didn't even go that far. Let's see. Clarify this confusion here. Uncertain, unclear, unsure. Okay, so we have the Six of Cups. The Six of Cups is here. Somebody's confused why a person needs to walk away or has walked away. Two of Pentacles is in reverse to the Sun card. Somebody may not be telling or going into depth about why they had to walk away or, or go somewhere different or whatever this is. Or this is about a past life connection. Somebody's confused about a past life connection or a certain thought about somebody, okay, or how they feel. Somebody is very um, disconnected from their emotions towards someone. Or that's at least what somebody is trying to make you believe. The two of pentacles in reverse to the sun card in reverse. Leo, earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Hmm. 
something is unbalanced and disorganized okay somebody's unhappy with some type of imbalance or disorganization of a situation what's the six of cups to this confusion for Virgo okay so we have the star card Aquarius and we have the nine of wands so Pisces, Sagittarius, energy is significant. Somebody could be seeing 9, 17 a.m. or p.m. on the clock, or this could be somebody's birthday, September 17th. Okay, so there is a past life connection, or there's somebody that's thinking about a person or, or a connection that they have towards somebody. Somebody could be a star, someone that's in the spotlight or someone that is aspiring to be a star somebody feels like they they are being uplifted by the universe or granted some type of energy to inspire others somebody here is being fulfilled with something or there's a hope or desire to renew or or rejuvenate something there's somebody that carries a stubborn energy and uses defensive mechanisms to refuse to compromise. Somebody feels like you should, it should be a privilege to even talk to me. Like somebody is very arrogant and self-centered. You could have someone that they think that you're starstruck over them or that you're jealous of their connections to people in the entertainment industry okay but before you even knew that they were what who they are who they are you had some type of connection to them somebody here is just like they're they have a big ego we have um happiness success optimism vitality confidence truth so it looks like something is being made apparent about somebody's confidence level it's like somebody has a big head like and I'm not saying like disproportionate wise, but I'm saying somebody's head is swollen with ego, okay? And I feel like you're disappointed in the way that somebody thinks that they could treat you by causing you confusion because one minute they're one way and the next minute they're the next. I feel like it's causing a rift in this relationship. Okay, you're trying to avoid conflict as much as possible, but how much are you going to take here? What's the message? Clarify the sun and the knight of cups for the star. Okay, so we have emperor. This could be somebody's father, boss, or a family-oriented person. Um... This could even be a grandfather, even for some of you. But this is like an older, more mature person, somebody that's practical, disciplined, has authority or control. Um, there's an Aries here that may be very insecure, but seems like they have everything under control. This is somebody that can outsmart you, even by putting on some type of poker face energy. Somebody is very materialistic. Somebody here is really focused on just making money. Like they're not focused on anything else. Somebody is playing you like a fiddle, okay? Somebody feels like if they are to change something or go with a pattern of, of going in a different direction that they may not have certain assets. So you're, you're going to stay in something with somebody that doesn't treat you right or feels like they could hang something over your head and take it away whenever they want to. Okay, I feel like you you are just um somebody's delusional. I'm sorry. I'm gonna call it like it is. Somebody's very fucking delusional. Hell no. Nah. I don't give a damn. If I have to struggle, I am not going to stay in something with somebody because they have money. Or something like that. You got to make your own way. Because what if they decide they don't want to be with you? What if it's not up to you to say whether you want to be with somebody or not? 
because it looks like there's some type of like um, imbalance in a situation. You feel like you made a bad choice choosing somebody or somebody feels like this towards you. Or this could be just how you're feeling in the moment. The two of pentacles. Yeah, somebody's trying to balance something with the person that they're dating that's not being balanced properly or it's only balanced for X amount of time. Somebody feels like they're, there's some type of burden or responsibility that they want to just, you know, end exit with. Somebody here definitely is focused on their skill, talent, craftsman, craftsmanship, quality, high standards. Somebody is focused on some sort of project or whatever this is. They can't handle anything outside of um, career or whatever this is. It's a no. Somebody here is going to have to, you know, take the L and move on. Anyway. Let's see. Somebody feels like you could be a distraction to their work or whatever it is that they're trying to build. There's an emotional storm in a marriage. Okay, somebody could be a Cancerian. You're protected from negative forces beyond your control. You might need to take a vacation or physically or mentally separate. We have compliments from an admirer. So I feel like even though you're a part of a relationship, you see people that, that visualize your you see people that visualize your um, your potential it's like why isn't somebody seeing this they have what they have at home but they don't see your true potential we have period of frustration somebody's confused about um, somebody's frustrated about how confused they are this is a lesson to be learned okay we have March Somebody could be a Pisces, or somebody needs to use their intuition. Do not be tempted to lower your standards, okay, because somebody wants you to be boxed in or you have to agree to something. I feel like um, there's a fire sign that could have a passionate love or hate for you, okay? This could be a Capricorn, or somebody with Capricorn in their chart, or this could be an event, okay? Somebody is trying to use something to attack you. Because they feel like you're stubborn or aggressive. Beware of greed. So let's expose the hater. It says forces are working against you. Alright, so your closest friends hold grudges against you. I told you, I said retrograde earlier. So Mars retrograde is significant. So there's an impulsive rage of anger or hostility or major blowout. Somebody here is trying to ruin your relationship with this person that may be someone of influence in their community on social media or in their job. Or this could be somebody that's a star, could be a model, a director, a producer, a singer songwriter a rapper this could be anybody okay or this could be somebody that's spiritually um spiritually known or highly ranked however it is that you see the star Phones turned off. Now we have coercion. Somebody was told to turn their phone off. Okay. For 10 days. Or something could be happening with coercion in 10 days. Tell me more for Virgo. What is it that Virgo needs to know currently at this time?
Okay, so there's an honest conversation that somebody could be dodging, but they know they need to have. We have rendezvous. Now we have options. A private getaway for two is calling you. Somebody wants to invite you or take you somewhere so that they can ha have an honest conversation. Somebody wants to tell you about the options that they co they've come up with. This has something to do with an alignment in their religion or religious factors. It's time to disconnect from the world to compromise. Somebody needs to work on compromising with their person or their partner in order to make something happen. All right. Anyway, Virgo, that's what I have here for your current messages. Hopefully it resonates. If it does, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, stay blessed. And I will see you guys in the next one.